Hello everyone, so quick overview of Taza app. So here is the app. So basically this app, uh, it's really helpful either for photos and videos to put some advanced filtering or some advanced like uh, edits to make your photos and videos more like cooler. So just tap in top right uh, and then you can just add a photo, for example. So then you just select it and then tap edit in the bottom. Okay, there are some issues. So it's just like a house. There are a lot of these like standard filters. Uh, uh, okay. And there are like free filters that aren't free. Then on the second uh, tab, we just have all this like brightness, uh, shadows. Uh, all that stuff, saturation, grain, temperature, so stuff like that. Uh, and then on the third top you have like dust. Uh, so these are three filters. There are, you have also frames. Uh, okay. Uh, so a lot of features are like you need to start a subscription. I think it's like four dollars per month or something like that. But anyway, so you have all of that, and then you just tap save. So you apply all these filters. So you can just copy, copy edit, and then select another photo and just past edit here, uh, and then you will apply the same settings as as you have applied for that specific photo. And then you can just select photos and tap save and then the photo will be saved to your camera roll and then you can just delete it. So that's about that uh, for the app. So that's super easy like guide how to use it. You also have all these like templates. I don't know like so you can have that and then you can just add like photo and stuff like that and then just save. Uh, uh, so there you have it So this is just like a quick overview in case uh, you guys are like wondering what this app is about It's actually getting pretty popular as you can make some advanced filters and Settings for your photos than in native Instagram or other apps like that